If your climbing shoes are so tight that you have a foot corn, this video will show you how to treat it. I've been wearing the same climbing shoes for over 7 years because it's very hard to find a pair of climbing shoes that fits perfectly. However, for some reason, the shoes have started to feel tight recently. I ignored the tightness initially, but the foot corn slowly developed on one of my toes. It got to a point that my feet hurt when I wore my climbing shoes. After a few more climbing sessions, eventually it hurt too much to keep the climbing shoes on and I had to climb with rental shoes for a few days. My toes doesn't hurt in the rental shoes, but they don't fit well and they are affecting my climb. I decided to reach out to a doctor and it's pretty cool that nowadays there is an option to get care by phone. After my conversation with the doctor, he sent me a follow-up email telling me how to treat it. He suggested I use a pumice stone and exfoliating cream to rub away the thick, dead skin. And then use a corn cover to prevent the thick, dead skin from developing until it's healed. So after I ordered the items from Amazon, I started to do what the doctor suggested. First, I applied the exfoliating cream on the corn. And then I simply moisturized the pumice stone and then started rubbing the corn with the stone. Initially, I was not sure how much force I could apply. But after watching a few different podiatrist videos of removing corns by medical scissors, I knew I could apply as much force as I wanted to as long as it was not too painful. After rubbing the corn for 15 minutes straight, the dead skin came off and my skin on the corn became a lot flat. You can tell the huge difference compared to the skin before I rubbed it. In the end, I applied the corn cover and hoped for the best. On the next day, I tried on my climbing shoes and I was so happy that the unbearable pain was gone. After a week of going through the cycle of applying exfoliating cream and reapplying a corn cover, the pain was completely gone when I wore my climbing shoes. After another week, now my toe looked like this. Therefore, I can conclude that this treatment works for me and it might work for you too if you have the same problem. However, this video is not meant to be medical advice and you should always consult a doctor for your own symptoms. Thanks for watching and as always, make sure to like and subscribe. See you in the next video.